Hello everyone, it's Steve with Aptera Owners Club. A few days ago, Aptera released episode 3 of their Aptera Myths Debunked series, um, where Quincy talks about a bunch of myths. And the last one was, you know, interesting because they are talking about the rap, and the rap has been a contentious issue. So let's listen to this. Because Aptera is partially wrapped, some people are concerned about the lifetime of Aptera's exterior finish. Aptera vehicles will be wrapped where needed, just on the sides. There's no wrap on the top or bottom. All right, so the wrap is just going to be, I guess, the silver area. Uh, the, none of this will be wrapped. And of course, the top won't be wrapped because these, this is, you know, let's go back a little bit. Um, where much of if we go back... This is obviously a solar panel, and this is a solar panel, and this is a solar panel. Now, what I don't know is these black areas right here where the logo is and the black part of the um, door and the A-pillars, like what are they going to be? I kind of think they're going to paint those because if you listen to what Quincy says, it says that they uh, el eliminates 98% of the painting. So they're still painting some things, like 2% of the things are being painted. So I wonder if they're going to paint these and they'll be painted at CPC or someplace um, because a paint shop obviously is super expensive and um, really environmentally not friendly. And uh, so th it is good that they're uh, eliminating that. But here we go wrap on the top or bottom where much of the potential damage to a vehicle takes place. We chose to finish Aptera with an extremely durable wrap because it is more environmentally friendly and eliminates 98% of the need for a traditional painting process. Okay, so I'll see 98%, so there's 2% that's still being painted. While offering essential UV protection to the composite body. Yeah, so it's right here. And, and so these aren't wrapped, so we don't have to worry about these. And I think the solar panels are supposed to have at least a 10 to 15 year lifespan. We also hope people will find it easier to repair damages or switch out colors of their choosing. We expect Aptera's film wrap to last five to 10 years in aggressive UV environments. We're testing with vendors now and we'll set expectations in warranty soon. Okay, great. So that's, so they say that they expect it to last five to 10 years in aggressive UV environments. So this means like Southern California, Arizona, that kind of stuff. If you look at, for a long time, we figured they were going to use 3M's vinyl wraps because 3M is kind of the uh, leader. And if you look at them, they don't even um, warranty their films in uh, high UV environments. And they say it's going to last like three to maybe five years at most, um, especially on, on, and they said on vertical surfaces. So you know, in Aptera, the, the sides are the vertical surfaces. On the horizontal surfaces, they don't even warranty them at all. I, it makes me wonder if they are going to look at paint protection film, which, I, which is really, you know, we've been talking about this for a while. Um, this was back in October when we released this video about paint protection films. They are polyurethane instead of vinyl, and they're much more UV resistant. Um, they have... Uh, they're, they have a very high degree of resistance to damaging effects of UV radiation. And these things will last a lot longer uh, than um, the vinyl wraps. So they said they're still looking at vendors, which means they haven't decided on 3M's vinyl films. I'm hoping that they go with the paint protection film, and I think that'll be a great solution. So they will the top, where it gets the most UV um, exposure, will be the solar panels, and I believe they're going to paint those other portions um, like, like this portion. I believe it's painted. Um, that's going to be my guess. Or maybe it's going to be uh, embedded pigment, um, just like uh, Sandy Monroe mentioned a little while back, and that just this will be um, wrapped, and, and this will be embedded pigment. That would also be a good conclusion. I'm, I'm guessing, actually, that this bottom part is going to be embedded pigment. And this is going to be aluminum. The belly pan is going to be aluminum, so that's got to be painted, right? I, I, can't, I can't imagine. If they're not wrapping it, that's got to be paint. Um, and they must come painted uh, from uh, CPC or whoever's making those body panels for them. Okay. All right. So tell me what you guys think is going to happen with these black areas. Is that going to be paint or embedded pigment? And this, I, I think at least a belly pan, that has to be paint. And this is, pro this is almost definitely embedded pigment. 
uh, in here if they're not wrapping it or painting it. All right. Well, I think that was good to know that they are they haven't finalized on 3M, and I'm still holding out hope that they're going to do paint protection film because I, I don't know too much about it, but it just seems like it's going to be the best solution, especially for UV resistance. All right. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day.